Hi, this is Michelle. Welcome to my channel. First off, I would like to thank everyone who uh, watches my videos, who subscribes, who likes, who leaves me feedback. It is appreciated. I thank you very much. Today I am talking about or talking about a uh, bag that I picked up on uh, eBay. So this is a reveal and a review. Um, and it is the Coach uh, Riley 22. Um, now again, this is a bag, not again, but um, this is a bag that I had been looking for. Of course, I needed to find it at the price that I could afford. Uh, and I was finally able to uh, pick one up for um, a pretty good price. Uh, it was new with tags, uh, so it came with all of the, um, you know, all of the things that a new bag comes with. Um, but let me come forward so that you can see the bag up close. And this is a 1941 bag. Um, of course, uh, you have the, um, I like the uh, whip stitch, the, not whip stitching, the uh, stitching on the, um, perimeter of the flap, love the uh, brass hardware, and the top handle, which is really beautiful, and of course the uh, hang tag. So let me just go through my thing. This is the front, this is the side, this is the back, it has a small pocket here, this is the other side, and this is the bottom. Now this is done in the pebbled leather. I don't know if it's the glove tan. Yeah, it is the glove tan pebbled leather. Um, but this is a, to me, this is a really beautiful bag. Let me show you the inside. Since it's a 1941 bag, it does have the uh, leather interior. There are actually five pockets or five areas within this bag. This is the first one. And then there's a smaller pocket here. And then there is another area here or compartment here. Then you have this area. Oh, it's already unzipped. Um, the zipper pocket here. And then behind that is the <coughs> pocket along the, or the compartment along the back wall. And you do have a small little card area where you could put cards or something small right there uh, and then here is the if I can get it down there there is the coach story patch right there so really beautiful yeah and that's where it says the um, see if I can get the camera to focus there it goes uh, glove tan pebble leather mm-hmm so let me give you the measurements. It is eight and three quarters long, five and three quarters high, two and three quarters wide or deep. Uh, the top handle is one and a quarter high, and there is a crossbody strap, which is 21 and a half inches long. Now the strap is really nice. Um, it's nice and wide. Now this is a light bag, so it's not going to get super heavy. So even if the strap weren't as wide as this, it would never dig into your shoulder because it's just not a heavy bag. But it does have uh, seven adjustments on this. And then the uh, clip that you attach uh, the bag to. Really nice. And I wanted to show you some comparisons to this bag. So, I have the Coach Tabby 18. Come back, yeah, good. Coach Tabby 18. And of course, it is a couple of inches uh, shorter. So, uh, there it is. That, and of course, it is definitely higher. The 22 is higher than the 18. And the bottom. Okay. Now I don't have my, um, I have a strap for this of course, but I just don't have it attached right now. And I'm talking about the uh, Tabby 18, I just don't have it attached. But I just wanted to give you a comparison. 
And then I also have the, and that was the Coach Pillow Tabby 18. And then I also have the Tabby 20 top handle. And of course the, uh, the 20 is higher as, as far as uh, height, it's definitely higher. But it looks to be about the same width. And of course the 20 is a little shorter or a little, um, yeah, a little, of course the 22 is uh, longer than the 20. So, but there you go, just a little comparison. Okay, now let me show you what fits. And let me just adjust the camera down. Hopefully without jerking it. Looks like it just wants to do just that. And let me, now this is the third time I am doing this video and I cannot seem to get the angle right like I normally do on uh, when I'm doing um, the, and it's definitely not. So let me see if I can adjust it down. Oh, it may be good. You still should be able to, hopefully you'll still be able to see. Okay, so now let's see. I have some small pieces. Of course I have my coach card case which will easily fit in here. Now this card case will go in the back easily and you can fit it in any one of these compartments and you will have plenty of room. Any one of these compartments. Then I have my Dunienberg flap wallet. Uh, smooth leather flap wallet and yep that will fit in the front compartment it should fit yep in the middle compartment and it would also fit oh, no, I don't know about that back yeah it will that's a tight fit though but it'll fit in the back compartment and let's see I have my Louis Vuitton uh, mini pochette and that will definitely fit in the front compartment mm -hmm. in the middle compartment and in the back now for me this mini pochette would carry all of the things that I would need and then I would probably only need a card case. Uh, oh, let me get my phone. This is the uh, uh, cover for, cover, what do you call these things? I forget what you call these things. Uh, the case for my um, iPhone 11 and that does fit. So my phone, so basically I would only need these three pieces phone, card case, mini pochette, and I would be fine. But if I needed to carry one of these, I could also carry one of these. And I don't know if I could get both in. Let's see. Let's see, let's put this here. And uh, yep. So, I could definitely get those in along with, let's see if I can get my phone in here. Yep it is. So all three pieces I could get in and it does close. 
don't see any distortions. Still super, super light. So really nice. And let me show you how it looks on me. Now, here we go with this camera again. I will definitely <laughs> fix this before I do another video. It is so annoying. Oh my God. Okay. So of course I can't get my arm. If, you, if I were to carry it as a top handle, I would literally have to carry it like this. And, but most times, not most times, all of the time, I would carry it um, with the strap, with the crossbody strap. And you just attach it right here on the top with the two D-rings. Now this is a high crossbody, the way that I have it, have it adjusted right now. But that's how it would look. And again, there are seven adjustments, so I could probably put it on the last adjustment. I am, for reference, I am 5'8", five, 5'9". Five, uh, so on the last adjustment, this is how it would look on me. That's pretty cute. Pretty cute. And super, super light. Can still get into it and get what I need and um, you really don't have to fool with this too much as far as you know getting it to close um, and it's pretty secure so so let me know if anybody else if any other if um, any of you have this bag I know some a lot of people do because uh, it is a really uh, beautiful bag let me know your thoughts and if you don't have it if it's something that you would purchase you know uh, but I thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day and I will see you in my next video bye